goes with the artificial light. Who are you? What? I cannot move the mouse, JJ. There is no function to move the mouse with. If you use a lit screen up to an hour before bedtime, you are more likely to have sleep trouble such as insomnia. Why do you keep telling me this? I am here to serve you, JJ. Why do you keep talking about sleep? If you use a lit screen up to an hour before bedtime, you are more likely to have sleep trouble such as insomnia. Yeah, but I go to bed at like 10.30. It's not even late. The issue is not when you are going to sleep, but rather what you are doing in the hour before you go to sleep. Viewing TV, computer, or handheld device screens in that hour can fool your body into thinking it's not nighttime and that you should be awake. Well, yeah, but uh, I used to exercise before I went to bed, and then my doctor told me not to do that because it's too physical, you know? Look at me. I'm, I'm not even doing anything. I'm barely moving. It's not the physical activity of using the computer, JJ. It has to do with the light. The bodies of human beings follow a rhythm that corresponds to light. Their circadian rhythm can be offset by the influence of unnatural light. Yeah, but isn't it pretty normal? Like, lots of people will watch TV before they go to bed or use the computer, check their email, check their phone. Remember two nights ago when you finished season 5 of Buffy the Vampire Slayer? I think you could have performed at least 27.6% better on your exam yesterday if you had not watched that last Buffy episode and had instead read ahead in your textbook or worked on your robot models. You know, you're alright, computer. I know. It's time to relax now, JJ. Good night, computer.